And here we're doing a wool rug for a client. This is a regular client. And we're also doing the staircase and both the staircase and the rugs are wool. So we're gonna have to be a little bit careful, but we're gonna be using safe products for the wool, nothing with any kind of um, acid, acidic products or, uh, or products that are too high in alkaline, but we're gonna be using the um, neutral range Odeban three and one. And here's the list of uh, machines that we're gonna to use today and the products. And of course, I'm gonna use that with for the, um, for the rug. I like the rayon bonnets work really well. And then there's the uh, wool safe, wool approved Odeban three and one. And we do this um, periodically. This is for a regular client, so we maintain her rugs. Um, she's got quite a few rugs. Uh, we're just working on the staircase and on the on the rug today. This particular rug. Um, I really like the the rayon bonnet. Um, it is about three pounds, so it's real heavy. Um, and it's really good at absorbing moisture. So that's what we're using it for today. And then with the Auric, we're using um, the two-way bonnet, uh, Auric stock bonnets. I feel it does a good job on the, um, on the wool. It's not so aggressive. And uh, I think it's a good bonnet for this. And this particular bonnet's not very aggressive either. I have more aggressive bonnets that um, that could slightly be too aggressive for this wool because this wool does uh, shed some, regardless of how you how you uh, clean it, uh, vacuuming. And I see shedding as well. So I did use the rotary because uh, I think it's a lot less surface tension than the orbital. In this case, for this particular rug. And we're just, uh, just taking our time. Um, and I always tell the client that, um, you know, if you want to get a deep cleaning on these rugs, it's best to take it to a wash pit somewhere, but we don't have a a wash pit in town where you know you can soak it and and uh, get it really wet and get all the, the the dirt out and pressure wash it out what and whatnot but but we're using this method this dryer method that's that's safe on on the uh, wool and I'm not gonna be able to show the staircase but you could see from the beginning of the video that it's pretty um, pretty big staircase and uh there's there we're on top of the staircase right there uh just no way i'm, I'm gonna film all that um but anyways i thank you for watching and take care